Hello my dear friends. In this video we're going to fix Windows System Restore error that says you must enable system protection on this drive. Not just that, as you can see, the next option is completely grayed out. This is highly annoying, especially when we try to restore the system for some of the critical Windows issues. With no further delay let's go ahead and fix it. Please close this window. Go to Troubleshoot and then Advanced Options. Please choose Command Prompt over here. Now we should execute these two commands one after another. I have provided these commands at the end of the video description. Before we execute the next command, we should exactly know what is the drive letter for your system partition. System partition is the partition that holds the Windows operating system and program files. Remember, it is not always C drive. Sometimes different drive letter gets assigned, especially when you're in recovery process. To know which is your system partition, please type disk part and hit enter. Now type list volume. Over here you'll see all your partitions. Precisely locate your system partition. Generally, you can exclude anything less than 10 gigabytes. Also exclude the USB or CD or DVD drives. With that said, I can assume my system partition is E. It could be different for your case. If you still have doubts, exit disk part and get into the suspected partitions one by one. For example, if you want to get into E partition, use E colon and then enter. Then use DIR to list down the contents. Wherever you see Windows and Program Files is your system partition. Let's go ahead and execute this final command. Please don't forget to modify the drive letter according to your system. This would open System Restore interface. Click Next. Choose the restore point that you wish. Choose Next. Please choose the system partition. As you can see, we no more get the error, and the next option is available to me. Please follow the on-screen instructions to complete the rest of the restore process. If you're still struck at any type of blue screen errors, please follow this video. This video provides all possible ways to get your data and system back. The link has been provided at the end of the description. I hope it was helpful. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.